What's up, guys? Live here with Pro Play Games with Patrick Hoban. A uh, little delayed deck interview from yeah. his uh, accomplishment uh, about a week ago at ARG Richmond. Yep. Uh, he placed top eight. Uh, what were you playing, man? I was just playing water. And how was your tournament experience? I was really good. Um, I don't know. I think this deck has really good matchups against like uh, ABC and Melo. Okay, and you played that today, also. I mean, yesterday, also at the ARG. Yeah. In um, I lost to. Uh, Cory Roca, he's playing Dark Lords, and then I lost to Justin Delhan just because I messed up. Like, I don't know. Um, it wasn't. It wasn't even like a really complicated play either. It was just like he was activating a C in graveyard with an A already in there, uh, and I had a toad on the field, and I didn't negate for some reason. I knew I showed up, and then I was just like, what? whoops. Well, at least you uh, helped out her PBG fellow yeah, PBG right. members. So, uh, all right, quality losses. Top. Let's check out the the deck profile. All right, uh, three Megalo. Um, three Aqua Spirit. Oh wait, actually, in Virginia, this was the one change I made in the main deck from Virginia. It was only two Megalo in Virginia and one oh, Turge. Oh, okay, okay. So you um, decided with Megalo now, you think it's just better now? Yeah, or? I never really cut, or I never really used the Turge effect that much, so I just wanted to cut him for this event. Um, but yeah, it was, uh, two Megalo and one Turge for that event. Okay. And then, two Pike, two Guns, Three Teus, two Dragoons. Um, these cards still suck, but uh, I did find out something about them that made them a little bit better. Um, I realized that uh, you don't necessarily need Teus, Instant Fusion or Teus Aqua Sphere mm -hmm. to go to the double Muhammad. Um, double uh, Toad, you can also just have Teus Pike even without Engineer. Um, so I ended up cutting Engineer for that event and this event. Because if you have Teus Pike, you can just go uh, Teus and... Where's Teus? Here's a Teus. All right, so you go Teus pitch some random water monster, and then you add Hill to your hand, and then you summon uh, the Pike, and you pitch the Hill to go get Osha, and then Osha, and then does this, so you get gunned in this, and then now you have the double Bahamut play without using Engineer. So there's no reason to play Engineer anymore. Um, and I played Engineer for Charlotte, I just didn't realize that was a play. <laughs> yeah, you learn new things about this deck every day. There's yep. so many plays, the yeah, decision right. tree is insane. Uh, three Prince, the card's insane. Um, two Infantry, uh, didn't play Marksman at all. That card sucks, I never used its effect. Okay. Um, Diva, uh, three Swap Frog, and this card's really good going second. Um, and then just one Ronin. Okay, cool. Those are all the monsters. Um, three desires, uh, one for one, three instant fusion, upstart, soul charge, and then two more. Uh, more I'm really back and forth on. It's sometimes good, like, I don't know, you have cards you don't want to draw, like the Hild and the Mander and Ronin and Tone, mm -hmm. but like, it's still really awkward, kind of for the same reason, like, Allure's awkward in BA, so I'm not like, I don't totally love the card, but I don't hate it either. It can fix bad hands. Did you ever try three and then you went down to two? Yeah, or I did. did okay. I, three was weird because it's like, if you draw multiples, it's a non-water card, so it doesn't work well with itself. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I, I thought the three was too much. Okay. And then the last card of the deck was one sphere. The Raigeki break? Yep, the Raigeki break. Also a lot better with the two infantries that you were playing. Yep, definitely. Then the extra deck, two Bahamut, three Toad. Uh, Gaios, Lightning, Utopia, Castell, 101, Dweller, Leo, um, Norden, and then I sided Cherries, so I sided uh, Darkmaw and... <laughs> that hero yeah. matchup so brutal. Yeah, it really is. Um, I got destroyed That's by the deck in California. Yeah, yeah, yeah in California got destroyed. Did you play any of this event or no? I didn't this event, but I did in Richmond. Okay. And I won a nice roll sign one. That's nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> That's what it comes down to. That matchup is terrible. Yeah, um, and then I played two Maxi, uh, two Gamma Seal. Um, then I thought that ABC was a really, really good matchup because when I was going first, like I would just make toads and they can't usually deal with it. And then like when I had to go second, I would just sign in three cherries and three system down. And it's like if you draw any of these, it's kind of like an auto win. Yeah, it's pretty much game. Um, and if you don't draw any of these, then that's fine too because then your hand is just a bunch of cards to get you to Dragoon. So your hand's auto automatically good no matter what you're playing. Mm -hmm. So I think ABC is like should be an auto win against this deck or with this deck. And then two Twin Twister and then. Um, 
three chalice that I can't find, but <laughs> I can't find. <laughs> I, I switched them to anti spell this event. Um, um, I didn't like chalice very much. Uh, it was for Alkahest, just because it was like the one thing you could chain to it. But um, at the time they were going like double fusion play, so it wasn't very good, and um, it doesn't deal with Kieran. So I don't want to like draw it when they have Kieran or you know not draw it when they have Alkahest. Like I don't know. I I just wanted something more. How was it this event? Do you wish it was switched back to Chalice, or do you do you still uh, like like the anti spell? Any okay. So, um, okay. But I think I'll, um, anti spell would have been better. Okay. Cool. Yeah. All right. Well, that's it. Cool. Thanks. All right. Thank you so much, man. See ya, Johnny.